guys. Welcome to Ballsy Bites. Today we're getting really ballsy with my favorite rainbow cake balls. I've been making these for a while. It all happened because I messed up with a rainbow cake and got angry and crumpled them into balls. Something you should be ready for is getting messy. It's going to look like my little pony blew up in your kitchen. Okay, the first step of the recipe. You put your white cake mix into a bowl. I think the smarter thing to do for white cake is to use egg whites. So you're going to separate the egg whites. Just put them on in there. Third of a cup of vegetable oil. But the secret to making these extra moist is adding an extra cup of water. And then you're going to divide this into six different bowls. Rainbow. Our next step is to spread out my rainbow. Please come a little closer. Start by pouring in the purple right in the center, whirling as you do it. And on top of that, you're gonna do the blue. And you can see the purple expanding. And then we take our yellow. Last but not least, Voila! I always wondered if that, is that him? Well by now your cake should be ready. I accidentally punctured it with my thumb. You probably shouldn't do that. You're gonna start with a knife and you're gonna wanna get another plate. Stab right in the middle. And you're just kind of cutting little slivers. But you'll see there's like it's harder on the edges where the purple is. That's why I said put more purple in. We're going to just cut off that little bit and just take off the bottom layer. Literally cup it and scrunch. So what you're gonna need for this part are some candy melts or white chocolate, either way. You're going to need your rainbow balls that you've worked so hard on, a bowl, a microwave, and some spranky dinkies. I learned that adding a touch of vegetable oil is really good for softening the white chocolate melt. We'll microwave it for 30 seconds, and after, I would do 15 second intervals. beautiful that turned out. Wow, look at that. Oh my. Well, that's it for our first episode of Ballsy Bites. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make these beautiful tie-dye rainbow cake balls. And if you make them, tag Ballsy Bites on Instagram, and I'll be sure to comment and say, oh my God, thank you so much for making them. And uh, stay tuned for next week. I will be making another ball for you.